to, to the leader's point, I think the one thing that people more than anything else want out of their government is competence. And um, what we saw in Afghanistan was a, a picture um, vividly displayed of incompetence. Uh, and in traveling South Dakota over the August break, uh, like a lot of my colleagues who were back home in their states, um, people were just outraged at how poorly executed uh, this exit was. And, uh, and they want accountability, and they deserve accountability. The American people deserve answers. And there are hearings underway already this week in the Senate uh, Foreign Relations Committee and hopefully uh, Armed Services Committee. There's some closed hearings this week. But there needs to be a public accounting by the, the diplomatic, uh, the military, the intelligence leadership in this country to the American people who deserve answers. Um, and if you look every, every, you know, on sort of every front right now, you see incompetence. The border is another good example. Over a million illegal crossings uh, just this last year. And uh, no end in sight. And no solution out of this administration except to, to uh, basically continue with the failed policies that they've implemented since they took office. It did away with the policies of the past administration that had been fairly effective in, in controlling that flow. Um, instead, what they seem to be focused on is a massive expansion of government, paid for with huge tax increases and lots more borrowing and debt. Um, this is unprecedented in terms of what we've seen in our country. Uh, you look at the um, three and a half trillion dollars is sort of the number that's being thrown around out there. But if you look at what the Committee for uh, Responsible Federal Government says, they're talking five and a half trillion dollars. And, um, and so we think, again, that this administration, Democrats in Congress, are completely out of step with what the American people care about. Uh, they don't care about a huge run-up in spending right now. They care about inflation. They care about America's pride, America's um, you know, dignity when it comes to the uh, situation in Afghanistan. And uh, they care a lot about controlling the border. Uh, what they don't care about is spending another $5.5 trillion on growing government here in Washington, D.C. So I hope that uh, over the course of the next several weeks and months, as we deal with some big issues here in the Congress, that the American people will begin to weigh in and start holding their elected leaders accountable uh, and make them responsible for the issues that are important in their lives and not um, continue down this path of incompetent leadership that we've seen so vividly displayed over the past several weeks.